Irons is basically surrounded by state and federal land. There'll never be any industry here just because it's uh, 80, 80, 90 percent recreational. You know, when you live where others vacation, you have to take that into account. There can never be enough tourism. We can't get enough people up here. Uh, you know, it just, you know, the goal is to bring as many people as we can. We don't have a million dollar grant like Traverse City does. You know, pure Michigan advertising type thing. This is an eight to 12 foot groomer. Inside the tractor, it's just like a joystick, just like playing a video game. You've got your little switches here and you just drive along. You take a torn up trail and when you look behind you, it's flat, smooth, and white, and pretty. And, you know, it's just a nice time to get out there. I enjoy my time in the tractor. Seven, <laughs> eight, nine, ten, eleven, twenty. Twenty, I got anybody 21? Anybody 21? I'm 25. 25. Oh. 25. You want to keep talking to me or not? <laughs> First hit of the night, it's over 25 bucks right here. I can take it for a Give her a hand, guys. All right, here we go. Let's go ahead. Down the middle of nowhere, a couple of churches and more bars. A lot of fun living here. I'm Mark Richard. We're at the Oak Grove Tavern. Belongs uh, to Wayne and Jackie. Uh, we're fixing to get the hat auction started. The hat auction started the year that I got the bar. I used to have the bar. The year I got the bar, a guy came in to me, owned a business here in town, and uh, said, You know what? We ought to have a hat auction for deer feeding and drill grooming. Basically, it was for deer feeding back then. And I said, who the hell's gonna buy hats? Well, guess what? A lot of people bought a lot of hats. If you haven't been to a hat auction, you haven't had a good laugh. It's fun. I want to thank you guys for the 28th annual Oak Road Hat Auction. 28 years! Woo! No one run getting so goddamn old. Every time you buy a hat, there's a kind of few there's no rules here except to have fun. But every time you buy a hat... Well, the guy that's running it, old Mark, he started it 28 years ago. This is the 28th anniversary of it. And uh, really what it uh, originally was designed to feed the animals up here. So now it goes to the snowmobiles. Uh, we run four big tractors out of this little area, groom 150 miles of trails, one of the finest trail running in, in northern Michigan. It's a, it's a outdoor person's dreamland. That's why I moved here. I'm like, I thought it was real cool. You know, I'm 18 years old. I'm going to move up there. It's going to be cool. Well, I moved here and it's all work, but I still get it. <laughs> Enjoy it. This bar in this town, the restaurant, we all solely to survive on what happens with the seasons. We're a tourist place, there's no industry. Our industry is tourism. So we want to give back to our industry as much as we get out of it. Sexy usually isn't this sexy. Who else would be getting old like me? Couple bucks I got over there. Three I got. Four I got. Four. Anybody five bucks? I think it's been going so long that the uh, uh, guys, snowmobilers, know where the money goes. They come from all over. Got a bunch of guys from Ohio, Indiana, Illinois. They make it a point. This is a kind of a destination for this weekend to come up and, and have fun. It's just wacky zany. 
we've had hats that are real crazy, goofy hats that we've gotten money for. There's, there's stupid hats that people just bid up just to get people bidding back and forth in the bid war. And I got burned on that earlier with that, that Snoopy Christmas hat. Guy says 20 bucks, I say 25, you know, whatever. But it's all for a good cause. And that's why, that's why we do it, just to have a good time. I think I'm so good to have about a thousand times. One thing I gotta work, you guys have to fly in, grab your beer out of the way. <laughs> 25 going on. You know, a lot of the groomers are proud to be out there. You know, they, they like going out and making the trails smooth and making them look like an expressway. You know, it's a cool thing.